left corners. Hand off to Cone for the touchdown. the Lambo leap. Rogers celebrates and then Jones attempts the Lambo leap. And the 67 yard run by Cobb. Rogers for Jones. He's got it. Touchdown. Okay, the other thing that separates him besides the lack of interceptions is the ridiculous accuracy. Come on, one more try. There we go. Get him up. Get him up. on the lead. Uh, there yeah. we go. Hey, he's got it now, ladies and gentlemen. Third the time's the charm, Goose. Lambo lead. Hey, this is just unbelievable location. <laughs> on the 12, they'll get another one. They were offside. Flacco can take a chance down here for the pylon. It is caught for the touchdown by Kelly Washington. We have two flags. I don't know if there are different fouls or not. All sides, number 97, defense. You know, Charles, the Lambeau leap is uh, obviously a popular thing here. If you're a Packer, the rejection. I mean, I was trying to find a Vikings <laughs> jersey somewhere because if you're going to do the Lambeau leap here, find someone wearing your colors and go in that direction. This one picked to the far side, Fred Smoot. Fred Smoot, only five to beat, touchdown Vikings. Find themselves leading in the ball game with 5-10 to play in the third period. Following an interception return for a touchdown by Fred Smoot, they're out in front, 7-6. Start at cornerback tonight because Cedric Griffin, the starter there, is out with a stinger. Smooth picking this one <laughs> off and taking it back 47 yards and getting rejected in the end zone. Well, they do it regularly. If you hit a home run, they just throw it back. <laughs> they just threw Smooth back. Shuffle, shuffle. Fake to Jackson. Wide open. Guess who? The tight end, Lee Smith. Sneaks around the backside. You know, both the, both defenses in the first half dominated really wide, and he he really struggled to get it down. 